who is the boy who is stressed about his cousin being in exclusion again, who applies what he's learned from his tutor, has plenty of boys and girls who are his friends. He is a nice boy. And I know a nice boy too. Well, a nice man. You know, there's a few. And in bed, he asks me if I'd like it if he surprised me whilst to sleep said that it must turn me on to be touched without knowing and I don't know how to say it scares me that he thinks that's okay. As if yesterday's consent made consent today, as if consent awake means consent to sleep. And I don't know how to explain. And I don't have enough spoons to talk about this as I'm stirring the sauce for our next dinner's dish when I talk about a girl, maybe drunk, who was raped by a friend and he doesn't understand that rape is rape. Just as bad as a stranger down the alleyway, as a friend who you trusted, somewhere you felt safe, the same as with a boyfriend. Later down the line, he sends me a video, asks if I know the poet Maya Angelou. But when I mention the parts where she says, I won't say severely rape, or rape is severe, it's like he doesn't hear. And I don't know how to say it scares me that he has that view. It's not that I don't trust him, it's because I do. And that marital rape wasn't illegal in time, until 1992. And the songs at the club say that consent isn't black and white. And that too many people think it's not rape if she doesn't put up a white. Like fear can't paralyze you. Like a grip can't fix you to the spot. Like alcohol can't knock you out. Can you connect to the But, um, so yeah, let's move on to our open mic first, and so let's start off with a big warm welcome for Zara.